Israel. But follow the counsel and the dictates of their evil hearts. You see how it's coming in again. And went backward. And not forward. He takes the voice of God to go forward. You want to go forward in life? In ministry, in family, in any dimension of your life, keeping the voice of God, obeying the voice of God is key. He said they went backward because they did not obey the voice of God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. They followed the dictates of their evil hearts. That means they did not pay attention to the voice of God. So this tells me there are two kinds of hearts. You have the hearing heart and you have the evil heart. If you are going to hear God, if we are going to cultivate the, 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 the ability of the grace to hear God, then our heart must be a hearing heart. We must check and we have anything that makes our heart evil. And shut the door to the voice of God. Because our heart is very sensitive. The Bible says, out of it flows the issues of life. Proverbs 4:23. The issues of life. Your heart, your heart is a treasure. Jesus told us, make the heart good. And what comes out of it will be good. If the heart is evil, what comes out of it will be evil. What defines you is not what you eat. It is what comes out of the heart. So we must guard our hearts. Let it be that it's only the voice of God that opens the hearts, the passwords to our hearts. Receptive. 
humility. It talks about incline. Incline that ear. Praise God. Incline your ear. And hear the word of the wise. Humility. Teachability. You are instructable. Hallelujah. So we must be humble. He said the meek 
the meek will he guide. So come before him with a humble heart. Hallelujah. A focused heart. A humble heart. You are creating the atmosphere. You are tuning in gradually. Number three. Stillness. Stillness. Isaiah 40, Psalm 46 verse 10. Psalm 46 verse 10. You will tune in. Allow me to be on your feet. And talk to God. Lord, give me a hearing heart. Let my heart not be rebellious. Let my heart not be happy when you speak. Give me a hearing heart. Let my heart not be dull. Help me to wait. Give me the grace of the waiter. Give me the grace to come. And patiently wait for you. Master of the universe. I come in reverence. I come in an atmosphere and attitude of worship. Can you lift up your voice and begin to listen? Strip yourself of all entitlement, of all rights, and come before this one who can speak and your life will change. Maron Haya Sotarema Gediasha. Bendo Riatanda Kabalasha Tarabadiata. Minister to him like they did in Acts chapter 13. Minister to him. Worship him. Reverence him. Hallow him in your heart. Maratelema Shadea Tanda Bakato Siata. Jebodom Retole Kadalia Tanamando Siata. Readers of Harden Hanta. Readers of the of the heart that is rebellious and evil. Readers of the heart that is insensitive to the voice. Let the heart align with you. We join in this afternoon by your help and by your mercy. In Jesus' name.